Hello everyone, welcome to Today in the NA. I'm Vinny Paraselli. Happy Veterans Day to all those who have served our great country. We've got a lot to get to today on the program. Our teams have been doing a lot on the ice, but also off the ice. We'll check out some of the activities going on across the country. We'll also give you an update on the fundraiser for the Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation. And of course, we'll preview some of the best games coming up this Veterans Day weekend. This week's loan commitment belongs to J.R. Perdion, as he has committed to Long Island University. From Strongsville, Ohio, Perdion has four goals and nine points in 14 games this season. He's in his second year in Odessa and has 21 goals and 44 points in his time there. Our teams are known for doing great things on the ice, but how about off the ice? Let's go around the league and check out some of the activities our teams are up to. The Aberdeen Wings were out raising money for the Children's Miracle Network. How about New Mexico wearing their Paws and Stripes jerseys for charity? And then we've got our Philadelphia Rebels out skating with their friends from Hollydale. There's a lot of good being done throughout the NAHL. Our fundraiser with the Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation is in full swing as we are in our second week of November. Let's take a look at where things stand as of now. Anchorage is leading the way with over $1,700 raised. New Mexico and Odessa have also surpassed the $1,000 mark. Philadelphia has just over $300, while the El Paso Rhinos round out the top five with just under $300 raised. On the ice, we've got a pair of series to check out. How about the top two teams in the Central running it back for round two, this time in Austin. The Bruins swept the Minotauros, which included a huge come from behind win on Friday as Austin overcame a 3-0 deficit and won in a shootout. So it's a three-point lead for the Bruins as they will try to extend that gap this weekend on home ice. Then we head south for a shutout between New Mexico and Oklahoma. The two teams are red hot and sit in second and third respectively behind Lone Star. We saw the Blazers ice setter a few weeks ago and it was rocking. Really looking forward to seeing that atmosphere in Oklahoma this weekend. This could very well be a playoff preview in the making. 26 games on the schedule for you to watch on NHL TV this weekend. Follow the league on social media for score updates and more content. Go to NHL.com for live scores and stats or download the NHL app and follow your favorite team. That's all for us here on this edition of Today in the NA. Be sure to join us next week when we break down the latest from the North American Hockey League. I'm Vinny Parasite. Thanks for watching, everyone, and enjoy your Veterans Day weekend.